Hello everybody, Trixie541 here, back at it again with another episode of Mass Effect. Now, um, a lot has happened since I actually got together with you guys. Um, as you can see, first off, I never start my videos in front of my tank. I have this time because, look at that, we've got some babies! We've got some new fishies here, so I hope you guys like them. I am planning on fully stocking this tank, um, but you know... Yeah, we got some new babes. It looks really good. I'm very happy about it. Anyways, uh, first things first before I get into the meat and potatoes of what I've done off camera. I hope you guys had a phenomenal weekend. I know I had a pretty good weekend. I had a lot of stuff happen at work. A lot of prep work was done. And of course, I've been messing around on Mass Effect off camera a lot more as well. So um, after I finished recording the last episode, I ended up taking a break, obviously. And then I ended up deciding, hmm. I'm going to see if I can hop on and play this weekend to see if I can figure out this armor situation. And you know what? I did. Turns out, there is a very much so a reason why I appear to be dying all the time. I barely had any armor upgrades or health upgrades or damage upgrades at all applied to my shepherd. And that also was a big reason why um, I had so much money. And I was like, I don't know why money is always such an issue in Mass Effect 2 on all the forums that I look at because it's literally not a problem for me at all. Well, <laughs> I went to the Citadel and I bought the fish. I also bought some more um, model ships. So I have a few more model ships as well now. Super cool looking. I'm actually really liking it because I never really paid too much attention to the model ships in previous playthroughs, but I really like them. Um, the Sovereign one is humongous. Uh, and I also, like, fully upgraded as much as I could um, biotic damage, tech damage. I got a bunch of different, like, heavy skin weaves and inserts for my armor. So I should not only be better at damage per second, but I should also be a lot better in the defense category. Hopefully we will see that reflected in our mission for this episode. But yeah, I just went ahead, got a bunch of upgrades, got a few little, uh, little like, you know, things for the ship with regards to my pets and stuff. Um... So I am pretty happy. Without further ado, last episode I had mentioned that this week we were going to start off with Liara's stuff. So let's go get our girl back on our ship. Thank you, Kelly. I'm actually really excited because I don't remember much about Liara's mission from when I first played through the game, but I do know that I uh, miss her and I would like to, um, how do I, there we go. Uh, I miss her and I, I want to I wanna get her back on board. Um, I actually don't, I think I'm getting Mass Effect 2 mixed up with Mass Effect 3. Because I know in Mass Effect 3 you help Liara out and she does actually like, god we have a lot on Ilium. Um, Liara has like a lot happening in Mass Effect 3, and she actually does take over Miranda's room in Mass Effect 3. I actually don't know if she's on the ship at all in Mass Effect 2. I think I had some overlap there in my memory that I wasn't recalling. Um, with regards to who we're going to take on the mission for Liara, I, I really want to take Jack on one of these missions because I do really like Jack. But in the same respect, I really like Morton, and I know he would be better in the lab. But I'm going back on my previous judgment. He's going to come join us for a few missions here and there because I cannot get over his dialogue. I love his dialogue so much. So, um, I seem to have upgraded most of them. I could give him Cryoblast, but I think I'm going to keep going for Incinerate for Morden as well. So we're going to wait on upgrades there. I did not buy any new weapons, so I'm going to leave that as well. I'm still holding out for the um, opportunity for me to get assault rifles back. I don't know which main mission unlocks that, but there is a mission that allows me to unlock assault, assault rifles for adepts, and I would like it, but I don't know where it is and which mission it is. So whatever, you know, it is what it is. We'll unlock it eventually. I'm just happy with my particle blaster for now. That shit's awesome. Oh, we've got a bit of a cutscene at touchdown. Is this dragging us into some story mission? Who the fuck? What's going on? I'm here for Liara. What's happening? Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. First off, thank you so much. Not sure who did that, or if it was just because I'm 
a quote unquote specter, but thank you. That was very nice of you. I love the white makeup. It really looks good on his face. Um, yeah, why do I get the free pass? What's going on? What's up with that though? Who instructed you to waive the fees? The order came from Liara to Sony. Oh. She also asked that I Oh my god. She's near the trading floor. Liara, our girl. God, I love her so much. Oh my god. You said Liara was here? What is she doing? Liara is one of Nosastra's most respected information brokers. Oh, nice. Nosastra is based upon trade. Information is valuable currency, and Liara has done quite well. As I said, you'll find her near the trading floor. She was looking forward to seeing you. I'm looking forward to seeing her, too. Now, I could ask her a whole bunch of questions here, but I really just want to focus on Liara. Um, attractions, very interested, but like, not right now. We need to go talk to Liara because that was awesome. And I feel like I need to thank her for doing that. That was very nice of her. Customs records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port shepherd. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane. Oh my god. Okay, so it looks like all things lead back to Liara anyway, which is great. Morgan's doing some excessive stretching. He's getting bored just standing there. I'm not stimulating him enough with the, all the mental capacities of the new planet that we just landed on. Anyway, um, so Liara will be here on the trading floor. There are a lot of shops. A lot of shops. And who wants to bet there are more fish in one of these shops? Because... Your girl wants to see the fish. Also, it says that she's on the trading floor. She has a full-on office that's labeled here in the map. I'm very excited about that. So, very excited. Um, Another thing is the girl named Samara is awesome. And she's got, like, a super, super long mission. So, I'm looking... I'm looking forward to getting Liara on the team. But it'll definitely... Or, not Liara. Samara. But it'll definitely take a hot minute. Where the hell am I going? Talk to Garus. Okay, what's up? We were always told that Ilium is one of the safest places in the galaxy until you fell off the grid. Sign the wrong contract, join up with the wrong company, or walk down the wrong alley, and it's as dangerous as anywhere else. Don't let this place fool you. It's no safer here than Omega. Cool. Thanks, Garus. Awesome great just perfect just what we needed another place to look out for all right um so i can listen to the galactic news i can talk to the asari i can talk to morden here asari building structure resembles hive tall buildings filled with drones mm, curious social dynamic many queens competing for hive leadership odd feelings around asari unfamiliar reminders of old fertility contract negotiations all right, cool beans. Excuse me, excuse me, are you Commander Shepard? Oh, I really want to go talk to Liara, but like, I also want to know what her deal is. She's got extensive markings and she's wearing pink. So like, what's up? You're Commander Shepard? I saw your, I guess you would say your aura. I'd recognize you anywhere. Alrighty, what's up? I was asked to give you a message if I saw you. It's from a friend you made on Novaria. Oh god, girl, my memory's shit. You're gonna have to give me a little bit more than that. I met a lot of people on Novaria. Could you be more specific? I believe the message itself should make it clear. Oh no. Shepard, we hide. We borrow. We build. But we know that you seek those who soured the songs of our mothers. When the time comes... Our voice will join with yours, and our crescendo will burn the darkness clean. Thank you, Shepard. The Rachni will sing again because of you. Oh, that's that's sick. That's awesome. I'm glad to hear that you're rebuilding. Are you somewhere close by? The Rachni Queen is not here. That message is one of many memories I carry from her. I encountered her on an uncharted world. She saved my life. 
more than that. She gave me a purpose. They aren't amazing people, Shepard. The galaxy owes you a great debt for giving them a second chance. Ah, I'm really, I'm really happy actually that I want to talk to her about that. I'm glad to know that the Rack and I are doing well. I didn't get this interaction on my first playthrough, so I'm really happy to know that they're doing good. I am gonna ask her a few questions though, because now I'm like legitimately curious. How did you find the Rachni? I was working as a courier. Pirates ambushed my ship, and I was forced down on an uncharted planet. I was badly injured, alone and near death. Then they found me. They saved me. Oh, that's cute. You obviously got off world again. Did the Rachni give you a ship? No. Countless workers repaired my ship. It runs better now than it did before. Oh, that's awesome. Keep us on the Citadel in a way. All working together, each with a purpose. That's awesome, actually. Um, yeah, what is her purpose now? Just to spread the word of the Rachni, or...? You said the Queen gave you a purpose. What do you mean? The Queen shared her song with me as I recovered. I saw the Rachni as only an Asari could. They are so beautiful and so vulnerable. They needed someone to purchase things they cannot make themselves. Someone to work within the system. An agent, if you will. I am happy to help. My life as a courier was empty and shallow. Now I'm helping a great race rebuild itself. I don't know why I can act so sus. I think that's awesome. Yeah. I'd love to go visit them. May I? Can you tell me where the Rachni are? I'm afraid not. I don't even have that information myself any longer. After I met the Rachni Queen, that information was removed. It's not painful, but I simply don't remember. I'll remember when I need to. And her caution is understandable. The galaxy isn't yet ready for the return of the Rachni. With all due respect, if you're sending them shit, how do you not know where they are? But that's fine. I'm not going to press. Um, I'm just happy that they're doing well. So I'm going to say thanks and we'll be on our way to Liara. Thank you for giving me that information. I'm glad my friend on Novaria is doing well. Be well, Commander Shepard. You will not see me again. Okay. Thanks for the message then. Sweet. Um... I don't know why I can talk to this bitch either. Uh, okay, so I'm supposed to keep going around here. Holy crap, Shepherd! I thought you were. Am I supposed to know this lady? Shepherd, the news said you were dead. What happened? No, wait. Probably classified. Forget I asked. You just have to lie. She looks it's familiar. I'm Gianna Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. You helped me mail Administrator Ananias. Oh my god! Yes! Happy to help. What happened to Administrator Ananias? He made the one mistake Novaria won't talk about. <clears throat> he got caught taking their money. He's doing a few years in white collar prison. Mm -hmm. More importantly, he won't work in the city again. Sit down. If I remember right, I owe you a beer. All right, fair enough, man. Nice! What brings you to Ilium? You know, that you can talk about. Uh, I'm just gonna say I'm on a mission. I don't really... She's a great person, but, you know. I'm working on a top secret project. Mostly putting together a team and doing research. Oh. oh. Talk to you later. And don't forget to drink your beer. Alright. Um, and now the interaction's over? And there's a note in the beer... So I don't know exactly what happened. Um, I had a pop-up on my computer about antivirus software for some reason. Don't know what's up with that. Whatever. But the interaction ended up continuing, unfortunately, and I have no idea what quote-unquote option it ended up picking. But she left, and now I've got a note in beer, so what's up? Uh, Shepard had to leave. Target saw me. Couldn't break cover. A sorry merchant smuggling schematics from Mavaria. Can you talk her into showing you good stuff? Oh, so we're helping her again? Okay. I don't think that's a time-sensitive thing, and I want to go see Liara. So, um... This is going to be the wrong way. I need to keep going this way. Yeah, we're not going to talk to the tech merchant yet. Of course. 
Um, now I'm past Liara's stuff. Liara should be hanging out here, is what it says, but I'm not seeing... Am I supposed to go to Liara's office? Maybe I'm supposed to go into Liara's office instead, so... Let's go into Liara's office. She'll be in administration, uh, I think. Oh, no, wait. Is that just... Did that say information? No. Transportation and shipping. Um... Would this be Liara's office? Yes. Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I'll make it simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Oh, wow. Nixeris, hold my calls. Cool, she gained some sh crazy sh confidence. <laughs> Aww, this is so cute. Yes, I missed you too, hon. My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. Yeah, no kidding. Damn. It's good to see you too, Liara. How are you doing? I mean, my mask is on, so you I'm can't really well. see me, but whatever. I've been working as an information broker. It paid the bills since you... Well, for the past two years. And now you're back. Gunning for the collectors with Cerberus. Oh, can I offer... I know she's gonna say no, probably, but like, girl... Shepard, I'm sorry. I have commitments here. Things I need to take care of. Okay, Jesus. I I didn't mean to set you off. You sounded a little stern there. I'm sorry. What kind of things do you need to take care of? Are you in trouble? No, no trouble. But it's been a long two years. I had things to do while you were gone. I have debts to repay. You sure you don't need help, girl? Listen, yeah. I want to help. I need someone with hacking expertise. Someone I can trust. Yeah, we got you. If you could disable security at key points around Ilium, you could get me information I need. That would help me a great deal. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Um, I don't know if this is going to set her off again. I'm not going to ask questions, but... If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. Yeah. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data oh no, I'm not good at hurrying. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. Awesome. Uh, I don't really care about Samara or Thane right now, so I just want to help her out. I'll talk to you later, Liara. All right, so let's open up Liara system hacking. Liara has requested help hacking systems on Ilium to gather valuable data. After hacking a system of vulnerable. Server node can be linked to Liara's machine. Okay. So, um, are those on my map somewhere? Find security terminals. Hack them. Uh, I'm assuming that's her lady. Is this a security terminal? Is there going to be a security terminal in here? It's transportation and shipping. There'll probably be a security terminal in here if I had to guess. Um, they don't appear to be marked either, and I'm not sure how many there are. Um, alternatively, there might actually be... Hold on, maybe I should check. Is there a security desk anywhere? Gateway to personal defense. Trading floor, Normandy, technology, tracking office. Tracking office. Maybe in here? We'll deal with shipping first, and then I'll go to the tracking office, because that would be my next best bet. Is this? That's just a galactic news. Come on, where are the terminals? Hmm? These two are being manned by people, so I'm assuming I'm not supposed to go there. You guys are probably screaming at me that it says where I'm supposed to go, but I can't see it. Um, it says security terminals. There isn't a security office anywhere, so... Holy crap, this place is huge. Police? I could go to the police. They probably... Where the hell am I? Oh, okay, perfect. I went the right way. Awesome. Um, is that a security terminal? Is this... It's not anything I can access. Officers... A lady... A 
door I can't go into. Am I supposed to get these officers away from their computers? Is that what's happening? Very clear and concise instructions were not given to me. This is a shop. Star charts. I don't need, why would I need star charts? Anyway, um, where the hell are the terminals I'm supposed to? I don't see Krogan anywhere. Have I seen a single Krogan in Mass Effect 2? I have Grunt on my ship. I'm so stupid sometimes. You, relax. Vax will never notice if few missing pieces. Um, no, security no. terminal? Security terminal? Where the hell are these security terminals? Garus and Morden following me around like, what the fuck is that lady doing right now? Honestly, it's Shepard. Just don't ask questions. Hello! Here's the security terminal. All right, so we've got a little bit of white and a lot of blue to start us off. There we go. And then a line of green and white. That's this one here. And then a smidge of blue. Smidge of blue, smidge of blue, smidge of blue, smidge of blue, smidge of blue. There we go. Cool. Use the distance meter to locate the vulnerable system. Awesome, 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 awesome. All blue rows of Ilium. Let your roots dig deep. Bam. Was that it? Was that it or are there more? Because that was that was a little bit more intense than I would have liked. Um, okay, so systems, there are multiple. That was one. Oof. Um, what did that look like again? Oh, they're all different. Oh no, okay, this is gonna be a stressful time. Um, okay, orange, white, and green. Uh, orange, white, and green. Uh, fully blank, basically. That's this one here. And then we've got a lot of green. All right. A lot of green, a lot of green, a lot of green, a lot of green. Come on. A lot of green. All right. Where are we running? You're sure gateway weapons and armor. The stores over where are we running? Where are we running? Where are we running? Come on. 20 some. 20, 17, 16. 15, 14, 9, 8, 7, 6, this one. Awesome. All right, so that's another one. Oh my god, there are a lot of these. Okay, this is, I don't like how stressful this is. Uh, a little bit of blue and a lot of empty space. A little bit of blue and a lot of empty space. Now we got um, white, orange, and green. That's this one here. And then a sliver of green. That's this one here. All right, where are we running? Where are we running? 31, 32, 31, 30, 29, 25. Uh, oh shit, I think it's the other way. Why can Shepard not run more? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Oh, thank god, it was only three of them. Really? That was Renegade Points? I'm sorry, absolutely not. I was helping my girl. I don't give a shit that, that was Renegade Points. It's for Liara's sake. It's not- it doesn't count towards Renegade. I don't care that I was hacking systems. It was for my girl. I don't care. I'm excited to go see, though. Like, it'll help her out, right? Like, I don't care what I'm hacking into, and I didn't ask for details. I don't need to know the details. I was just helping out a friend. And that's all that matters. I love her. Honestly, that whole interaction was so cute. I wish I didn't set her off when I asked her to come with me. I understand that you have responsibilities, girl. Like, I'm not trying to step on your toes. If you can't come, I totally understand. Um, but I want to help you out in any way, shape, or form that I can. And I'm glad that I did. There should be... There we go. Stairs to administration. That's where we need to go. So let's go give her the info. Or I guess she has the info already. I'm just reporting back. Hey, girl. Hey! See you again. Ye. Giving me that system data. Here, it's not much, but hopefully it will help you on your mission. Do you remember the Shadow Broker? With the data you got me, I may be able to find information caches from his agents. Okay. Is that good? Like. Are you on the run from the Shadow Broker? I can help you. 
Actually, it would be more accurate to say that the Shadow Broker is on the run from me. Oh, that's amazing. Not long after you died. Since then, I've been working to take him down. Oh, jeez, girl. I'm not gonna force her to come with me, girl. Like, she already said no. But yeah, what happened? Execute someone in cold blood. What did the Shadow Broker do to you? I was on a job with a friend. The Shadow Broker's people caught us. My friend didn't escape. I don't know if he's dead or being interrogated. But I need to find him. I owe him my life. Ooh. And I need to make the Shadow Broker pay for what he did. Oh, absolutely, girl. Absolutely. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. Thanks, Shepard. I will. Now, is there anything else I can help you with? Um, I'm not going to say let's get the Shadow Broker because she clearly hasn't asked me for any more help. And based on her current interactions with me, I really don't think it would be a good idea to push her. I'm just going to ask her how she is, and then um, I guess we'll ask for a lead on Samara, and next episode we might start Samara's stuff. How's your own work going? The data you gave me was extremely helpful. It gave me a target. Oh shit, the nice. The has several contacts here on Ilium. The most powerful is someone called the Observer. Taking down the Observer will put me closer to the Shadow Broker. I could use your help. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. How can I help you? This is garbage. Why? I'm helping Liara, bro. Like, tell me what I can do to help. Your data pointed me at logs kept by Shadow Broker agents. The logs were deleted, but it may be possible to reconstruct some of it. Yeah, what's up? Shadow Broker is cautious. His agents are referred to only by their title and race. My inquiries have narrowed the observer down to one of five operatives. A Turian, a Salarian, a Krogan, a Batarian, and a Vorchak. If you can refine the list, I'll know where to strike. Awesome. What's up? Do you have any specifics on these agents? I'm afraid not. Mixeris was lucky to get as much as she did. I was happy to help, ma'am. The data is our only hope of determining which one is the observer. And if we wait too long, they'll all disappear. Oh. Why? Okay, I get being paragon about certain things. We're helping Liara. Like, why do I even have the option to say no? I'm on it, absolutely. Data and tell you what I find. Thank you, Shepard. When you find something, call me on the radio channels you used in the old days. I can't risk handling this in person. Awesome, fair enough. Um, so I guess this is kind of going to be a background mission and I have to talk to all these races, maybe? I don't really know what that involves me doing. Um... Yeah, find data fragments on hackable terminals. Ah, okay, so it's more hacking. Uh, talk to Liara later and see if she has other problems that require assistance. Sweet. And I got Paragon points for that, so it was worth it. Um, so I need to hack into more systems. I also want to just walk around and see what's up with the shopping. I do want to talk to this girl. Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. Yeah, yeah, what's up? You're Liara's assistant. Liara relies upon me to acquire useful intelligence. I don't have her network of contacts, but I supply her with supplemental data. Awesome. It's really an honor to work with her. Yeah. I mean, Liara has clearly shown that people do respect her, so I just oh, wanted to chat, right. girl, to okay. see what you're all about. Thanks so much, lady. We off. Alrighty, and this is actually a hackable terminal right here, so let's get her done. Uh, we've got green, white, and a little bit of blue with mostly empty space. Green, white, with a little bit of blue and mostly empty space. Then we have an orange line with a lot of white. There we go. And then we have blue, white, and a lot of empty space. Blue, white, and a lot of empty space. That's so this one here. Awesome! Data point five. Fortress Trader has requested no further contact with the Solarian. Salarian is becoming more trouble than he is worth. Observer recommends a kill, but she may have a grudge. So, it's not a Salarian or a Vorcha is what I'm getting from this? Shepard, did you get any information on the Observer? Oh, shit. I was supposed to remember what that said. Fuck. Um...
Uh... Oh, shoot. I legit don't remember what it said. Um, I'm going to say not yet because I don't feel like she wants to kill someone. So I feel like I don't have enough information yet. Let me search for more data. I'll get back to you. Thank you. Let me know what you find. Find more data. Look for more data fragments. Okay. Okay. We're good. Awesome. Um, but you know what? we're actually going to have to leave it there folks. <laughs> so we are going to leave it there for today. I had a lot of fun messing around with you guys at a lot of fun recording and we did a lot for Liara, not a lot, but like a little bit. We got to meet her again. So that's all that matters. Um, instead of starting Samara stuff, like I had originally said uh, a little bit ago, we are actually going to continue with Liara stuff. Cause I didn't realize that her mission was so involved. I did legitimately none of this uh, in Mass Effect 2 when I first played through it. So I have no idea what's going to happen. But I'm excited and now I know that I need to remember more information. So um, I've got data log five. Next episode when I see you guys again on Thursday, we will try to find the rest of the data log so that from there I can like cross-reference all of it together and maybe we can fill out, figure out who we need to murder. So yeah. Um, but yeah, I had a lot of fun. I'm looking forward to seeing you guys on Thursday. Without further ado, I hope you guys have a fantastic middle of your week. We will see you again later. Bye-bye.